Hi everybody, this is Suzanne here taking a look at Queen Strike from Ho Play Games. I was lucky enough to get an early copy of this really innovative game and I wanted to show off uh, kind of the really fascinating part of it which is of course this holograph generator that you build um, and how it interacts with the game components themselves. Um, the arcade that you see here comes packed flat. You have to assemble it yourself. That was a little bit nerve-wracking, but it was very cool. And it actually has 3D components built into it. So it's hard to see uh, because of the way the lighting is, but there's actually castle uh, turrets and things like that. And it looks like the queen is strolling back and forth on this little dais. Um, I, I realized it's hard to, to really see the impact of the holographs uh, on video and I'm sorry about that and I tried to lower the lights to make it stand out a little bit more but then I realized the camera wasn't picking up on the detection zone which is necessary to interact with so uh, this is about the best I can get it but um, be aware that the holograph impact is actually pretty cool the way it looks it just might not translate on camera as mentioned, there is this detection zone down here, and the iPad up here is positioned so the camera can see the detection zone, and that's really how the interface happens. And the way it works with Queen Strike is that you're going to get just a few cards, really. You get uh, an event card, you get a cannon card, each character has their own character card, and then um, you get these kind of rock, paper, scissors cards as well. And Queen Strike is really a game meant for kids. The mechanisms are dead simple. It's like roll and move, and then rock, paper, scissors. But uh, the way that the events work and the way that the app work adds so much interaction and so much charm. My daughter, who's seven, just gets a huge kick out of it, and um, it actually has been a lot of fun. It doesn't hurt that the design and the animations and everything like that on the board and in the app are really cute and um, engaging. So let's just take a quick look at how this works. So let's say you're going around the board and you run into a guard or you want to challenge that. So you just put your character card. You can see that the app picks up instantly on it. It's it's really quite cool how that works. Okay, now we're just going to play Rock, Paper, Scissors. So I just pick one of those cards that I want. And again, you can see the app picked up on the fact that I played my paper hand. Yay, and I won! Huzzah! And then uh, the goal of the game is to get these notes. So I get to put another note on the board. And it picks up again instantly on it, which is so cool. And when you think about it, this just means that there's a ton of expansion opportunity uh, with low production efforts because you can just change in the app what these different components mean. The detection zone works great. Here's an example of where I just have to tap on it with my hand. And keep in mind, this detection zone, it's just a piece of cardboard. Um, and really, it's the app camera um, that's picking up on how it works. So let's take a look at an event. The wondrous door of Hadrid appears. Where will he lead you to? Laughter River. Oh, good. We get to go to Laughter River. How exciting. So tap on that detection zone again. Hopefully you're seeing how easy and simple this interaction is. It um, It's just super intuitive, which I really, really like. Let's toss a different character card down there. This queen is super grumpy. So pull that card back. All right, let's play. There we go. Oh, we tied. Um... And really, that's all there is to it. You're going to be rolling and moving around this board, encountering different events, and then using these detection zones and cards to interact with the app. The is Everybody be so there's the cannon card when you activate that, and that kind of goes around, and then it eventually fires a cannon at you, which is pretty cool. So what I found with this, it's engaging, the design is great, it's fun, it interests children, it might feel a bit gimmicky, but it works, which I think is the key thing. It just works seamlessly and effortlessly. And I really respect and appreciate the innovation and creativity that went into this game. So hopefully that was an interesting peek at Queen Strike from Ho Play Games and the holograph and detection zone interaction. 
thank you so much for watching. Up. Oh.